Hello everyone, this is Robert Edmonds. I'm an M&A leader here at Black Diamond Mergers and Acquisitions in Fayetteville, Arkansas. I wanted to talk to you a little bit of today about some ideas around having intention and in creating a good culture in the workspace. We see a lot of different companies, obviously, through what we do, and um, there's, there's cultures that happen by happenstance, and there's culture, cultures that uh, have intention behind them and uh, has good outcomes for the owners and all the employees. So I wanted to give you a few things on a long list of things you can do to have intention around creating a great culture. So um, I've got a few things up here on the board. I uh, wrote them up here. Uh, one is, and these are in no particular order, uh, one of my favorite is just having an open door policy. Now, depending on the size of your business and scaling these ideas, you have to get this throughout your leadership team. But having an open door policy creates uh, some really good things in the workspace where employees feel like they can come and talk to you about uh, anything that's going on uh, in your operations and in your business. And that's key to be able to keep your thumb on what's going on and uh, being able to address those things proactively. I've had situations even in my own personal career where I thought everything was great and it wasn't. And having an open door policy where people feel like they can come talk to you is very important. Um, another thing is, and this is one that uh, is easily uh, a rule that can be broken, and that is equal treatment. Um, you can find that the employees, uh, you might have some that you gravitate to more than others. And so you may end up going to lunch with them. You may end up um, uh, spending time on the weekends with them. Um, what that will do is that will percolate throughout the organization. Everybody in there will know it. And in the end, uh, that's not a great place to be. And uh, it's a hard one to, to, to manage, but in the end, you want to treat everybody the same and you don't want to be perceived as though um, you have favorites within your organization uh, that can really affect morale in a negative way. Uh, another area of importance is coaching and development for performance and um, giving people feedback. A lot of employees have never been coached that I've come across or given feedback on their jobs and your ability to sit down and coach them uh, through a behavior issue or a relationship issue or uh, how they conduct themselves with customers, etc., is, is very important and not only rewarding for yourself, but be very rewarding for the employee and huge uh, positive impacts that can happen out of that alone. Uh, and with that uh, comes appraisals. Um, at least once or twice a year, sit down with your employee um, minimum at the end of each year and give them an appraisal of the work they're doing, um, the good things that they're doing and the areas of opportunity for improvement that they need. Um, it's really good to do a mid-year and a year in. Uh, another area is one-on-ones, which is kind of ties into the open door policy, but uh, if people aren't coming to talk to you, set up one-on-one -on -one time where they can have a safe place to come and have an open conversation. Now these things kind of take time to develop and sometimes employees won't open up to you but you can just ask them how things are going you know how are they doing ask about their family without getting into too too much detail but um, really taking a personal interest in them setting some time aside on your monthly calendar to reach out and touch and and, and have conversations with those employees that a touch point is very very crucial and that opens up that opportunity again for open door policy and where they feel more comfortable in engaging with you. And then the last one I talk about is core values. Uh, do you have core values that are published within your company that are posted that everybody can rally around that sets the tone on how you will operate, work together, work with your um, uh, fellow employees as well as what do you look like as uh, the shadow that you cast into the um, the uh, customer arena and how you uh, how you hold yourself out as a brand and core values are very very key so that's another area of opportunity so that kind of wraps it up I've got a whole laundry list of opportunities where you can impact your culture and your business if there's anything we can do for you here at Black Diamond, please reach out or if you have questions, give us a call 
I'll be happy to help you um, scale this to your appropriate business and have discussions around that. So we appreciate it and have a great day.